Operation video of aerobic count plate Wear lab coat, mask and gloves Wipe gloves and operation table with alcohol cotton ball Light the alcohol burner Wipe the packaging Open the seal, take out the count plates needed for test Mark the count plates Vibrate the diluent evenly Pipette 1 ml sample solution and drop onto the center of the plate vertically. Cover the top film slowly and the solution will spread automatically. Pressing plate is not required. After the solution spread is complete, transfer the plate to the culture room through the pass box. Incubate the count plate at 36 degrees with 1 degree tolerance for 24 hours to 48 hours. The count plates should be stacked upwards and no more than 20 pieces during the incubation. Interpretation After incubation, bacteria will show red colonies after growing on count plate. Counting visually or use colony counter or illuminated magnifier. Counting range 30 to 300 CFU. Notice Tiny red colonies should also be counted. When there is obvious colony dispersion, a mass of dispersion is recorded as 1 CFU. If there are too many bacteria colonies, please select several representative small squares to count the average number of the bacteria colonies and then multiplied by 20 to get the total number of the bacteria colonies. When the color of the whole count plate is changed, attention should be paid to the colonies of the next dilution factor. If there are obvious colonies and within the optimal counting range in the next dilution factor, the number of colonies should be counted. If there's no colony appeared, the count plate has been polluted. Precautions When uncover the film, do not touch the culture area of the medium. The count plate should be stacked upwards and no more than 20 pieces during the incubation. Keep the count plate away from ultraviolet, direct sunlight and fluorescent lamp. Do not use the polluted count plate. Count plate may contain microorganisms that can be a potential biohazard. Please follow relevant law and regulations for disposal. The count plate may show a few needle-like black spots, which is normal and does not affect the interpretation of the target strain. If the sample is viscous, diffusion can be aided manually. After sample is added bubbles may appear near the barrier, which may result in an incomplete diffusion of sample solution. This is a normal phenomenon and does not affect the test results.